In this video, we'll learn to recognize and calculate equivalences between common fractions, percentages, and decimals. So I've got a bar here, which has been cut into equal parts. That represents from zero to 100% or the whole, or zero to a whole as well. So it means the same thing. What we're using at the top is decimals, at the bottom is percentages. So we'll try and use fractions, decimals and percentages to find the equivalent versions of them. So let's have a look first at this amount. So up to this amount, which is here, what would that be as a fraction? As a fraction, this will be 1 out of the 10 or one ten because that ten overall and this is just one of them now what is that equal to as a decimal so if I am to put a decimal there what would that be that is the same as saying one divided by ten or one out of ten and we should know that 1 out of 10 means 0 0.1. So I'd go 0, 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0 0.5, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, 0 0.8, 0 0.9, and then 1. So this is the same as 0 0.1. And 0 0.1, 1 out of 10 or 0 0.1, is the same as 10%. I always relate this to pence. So if you see this amount, it would mean 10 pence. And that links with percentage. So this both start with P. So with a calculator, I would do 1 divided by 10. So that gives me 1 tenth. As a decimal, that's 0 0.1. And that is... 10% as well. So if you multiply it by 100, as that's another way, that gives you 10%. Now let's have a look at this one here. So this is going to be 2 out of 10 and it's going to be 0 0.2 and also 20%. So you can see the pattern. This would be 3 out of 10. That would be 0 0.3. 30%, this would be 4 out of 10, 40% or 0 0.4, this would be 5 out of 10 or half. So half is 1 out of 2, which write as 0 0.5 and that is 50% as well. And this would be 6 out of 10, which is 0 0.6 or 60%, this would be 70%, 7 out of 10, or 0 0.7, and this one would be 75%, it is 7 out, 7, 75 out of 100, it is 0 0.75, and it is also 3 quarters, so 3 out of 4. And if you do this with the calculator as well, 3 divided by 4, that gives us 3 quarters, which is 0 0.75. And that is 75% as well. So this one here would be 8 out of 10, which is 80% or 0 0.8. This would be 90%, which is 9 out of 10 or 90%. This is 95%, 0 0.95, and it is 95 out of 100 as well. And this one here is 5%, which is the same as saying 5 out of 100 or 1 out of 20. And we write that 0. 0, 0.05. Another common fraction is 1 eighth, so 1 out of 8. And if you use a calculator, 
1 divided by 8 that gives us 0 0.125 which is the same as 12.5 percent if you want to work this out in your head then you'd probably do cut this into four equal parts first which means you get quarters which is 0 0.25 but then cut those into halves again so that gives you 0 0.125 which is 12.5 percent so the way to turn any fraction really into a decimal and then percentage you'd be write the fraction so let's suppose it's two over seven or two sevens and you divide two by seven either by hand or in your head or using a calculator so two divided by seven that gives me this decimal which is 0 0.29 I'll round it up so 0 0.29 now as a percentage that would be 29% so any fraction divide the top by the bottom turn it into a decimal and then you can see clearly it's like pens in a pound or multiply by 100 and it will give you the percentage.